In this video lesson I will show you how to use Fibonacci calculator to get retracement and projection levels with simple calculator on the Get Neural Trading website. A link for the Fibonacci calculator you will see and find below in the description below this video where you will have also uh, information how the Fibonacci calculator works and what it is. Fibonacci calculator is a forex calculator for retracement and projection prices with, with Fibonacci levels. Here on the right side I have a chart with a EURUSD daily time frame where I will show you how to use Fibonacci tool for the retracement and also for the projection levels on the chart directly so you can see how the Fibonacci calculator, the levels that it calculates with the price levels are the same when you use the Fibonacci tool inside the trading platform. With this calculator you can get easy Fibonacci levels for trading analysis to see where the resistance or support levels are. With Fibonacci levels you can also maximize the projection of the stop loss and take profit levels because the uh, Fibonacci levels for the retracements and also for the projection gives you also support and resistance levels on the chart. Let's see and start using this um, Fibonacci calculator. Here you have first field where you have a drop down menu to select where is the tr trend direction. You have up and down and the, on, the, uh, on the right side from this field you have this checkbox to select a retracement or projection. Below that you have low price and the high price which you need to enter so the calculator can calculate the values for the price levels. For example, I have low price and high price uh, entered and when I click calculate I get the levels for the retracement for the uptrend listed here with the prices that I could see on the chart. Now when you change the direction you will see how the, also the calculation is different. So pay attention to select the proper direction and also when you calculate the projection you will see that you have additional field where you need to enter the enter price. I will show you on the chart what this means. First of all let's for example take the trend direction for the retracements that will be uptrend. Let's go to the chart and find low price and a high price. When you have the trend direction up which means the uptrend that means that the price is currently heading from just a minute to use crosshair from the low price to the high price and I will use here Fibonacci tool for the retracement and I will draw and I will put this tool directly on the chart okay now you can see what this means for the uptrend you can also here see this small image that tells you that this is the low price this is the high price so the retracements would go from the high price towards to the left price because when you have the uptrend the price is starting to reverse back going back down so this is the first level 23.6 then you have 38.2 and this Fibonacci tool here also have the prices visible right here on these Fibonacci levels which is very helpful to see what is the current price. So first of all you need to enter the low price and the high price here in the Fibonacci calculator and to get these values you can see it here. The first one is 1.05243 05243 which is the low price and the high price is here 1.191920. When you click calculate you get these Fibonacci levels. These Fibonacci levels I will not explain in this tutorial because this is the lesson uh, how to use the Fibonacci calculator but you can find on the internet many informations about Fibonacci levels. So first is 23.6 which is 1.0958 so let's see on the chart you can see this Fibonacci tool is has the same value for the price level for 23.6 Fibonacci level. So for the 78.6 you have here 1.0646 and here you have 1.06458. You can see that this Fibonacci tool calculator has rounded this number so it is the same one. So this is how to use in the uptrend. Now let's see how to use the Fibonacci calculator for the retracements when you have a downtrend. So let's delete this one from the chart 
Now we need to find where is the current downtrend. We can see that the market is moving from the, this high price to the, this low price, so we have a downtrend. But in this case, we would make this like this. So we have the downtrend, so we would put Fibonacci tool from the high price to the low price. So when the price goes back up, making a retracement, we would like to see where these levels are. You can see that the Fibonacci tool on the MT4 trading platform has uh, put all these values and the Fibonacci levels here with the prices. But let's see and use Fibonacci calculator so you can understand how to use this one. So we have low price and a high price. The high price is, is this one, it is the same one. You can see it here and the low price is 1.06.16352 when you click calculate you get these levels 23.6 retracement level when the price is going down making retracements it goes to 1.07430 which is the same one as this now when you go here and see for example 161.8 we have 1.1374 which is the same one as this here on the chart so you can see how to use a retracement for the downtrend now this is for the retracements i would like to show you now how to use the projection and the projection for example let's start with the uptrend means that you have a low price high price and the end price so when you enter these three values, you click calculate, you would get also the levels with the appropriate the price on the chart. So how to use the Fibonacci tool inside the MT4? Go to Insert and Fibonacci and you will see the expansion. So when you have the uptrend, you need to find where the trend is going up, then making a retrace down and then you project where the levels could be in the uptrend for the future move up. So in our case, we have here the uptrend going up, then making a retracement, and then we could expect the price could go up and we could calculate where the projection levels are. So for example, let's put this one here, start from here and put it to, to the high price. Let's put this one here. Let's put this one here to the low price and make this one end price where the retracement is. So this is the retracement where the price has made in the uptrend. So we are calculating where the projections levels are. You can see that the, this tool inside the trading platform has done this for you and you have these Fibonacci levels with the proper price. Now let's put this one in the Fibonacci calculator so you can see how the calculator gives you the same values. So the low price is this one here but you do not have line here, so it is not easy to uh, see the correct price. You, you could go here, click the right mouse button, get the expansion properties, and you have all these three values visible here. Just simply and copy paste them. So the low price is this one, the high price is this one, and the end price is this one. Click calculate. These are the levels you get. So 61.8 is 1.0993. When you go here in, on the chart, you can check here 61.8 is 1.0993. One. This one is four digits, you can see it here. And this one is five digits, so it is a round number. But the idea to what is the projection levels are is where the price could go from this retracement. So the first one is 61.8. To give you uh, information how this is calculated, calculated, you can go here inside this article and you will see Fibonacci retracement uh, formula. You can see for the uptrend and also for the downtrend. You can see how to calculate. Oh, sorry, here is the small error. This should be DR, which is downtrend. I will fix this later on. So also you have an information how to calculate manually Fibonacci retracements so you can understand the logic behind this one. When you go down, you can also see the formula for the projection and how the projection is calculated. So here is the levels for the projection. You can see how it is calculated, what is the logic behind it, and here it is the formula how you can uh, calculate manually the projection levels. 
it is also a formula for the uptrend and also for the downtrend. Let's go back to the projection levels here inside the calculator. So this is the case when you have the uptrend. So the price is moving from the low price to the high price and making a retracement and then you calculate where the projection levels are. Let's delete this one and let's change this one to the downtrend projection. So we are looking for for the market overview where we have a high price then the price is going down to the low price making a retracement and then looking where could the price could go in the future making a projection so let's go to the chart here and let's move a little bit back where we have a downtrend so for example we have a downtrend here let's go from here to here and insert fibonacci expansion which is a projection so let's move from the high price to the low price and select this one as a retracement as the end price okay now let's put all these three values here inside the Fibonacci calculator this is sorry this is the high price this is the low price and this is the end price see 1.14 this is okay this is okay now let's see this one here it's a little bit not visible let's move like this so we can see the 61.8 is 1.07137 let's see 61.8 is 1.0714 which is the same as this one but but this one is rounded so if we check here uh where the 138.2 is 1.01897 and we have 1.019 which is also around that number so when you can when you go to the chart here you can see how the projection tells you where the potential support or resistance are in this case we have a support visible here so when the price comes here to 100 you can see it is some kind of support when the price goes down to 138.2 you can see the price have small, some kind of confluence and then 161.8 you have also a support this is the way how this Fibonacci calculator gives you the projection levels for the certain Fibonacci levels you can see also how the market reacts on these levels you can use this tool on inside the trading platform but also you can also use this Fibonacci calculator to calculate the, the levels if you do not have this tool inside the trading platform so this is how to use a fibonacci calculator for the retracement and also for the projection for the uptrend and also for the downtrend here you have also the formula and also you have an example how to manually calculate them if you would like to calculate but also if you have any questions regarding this fibonacci calculator please leave a comment and i will try to make a new video to answer your question in the next lesson if you like this video, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and happy trading.